Hello and welcome to Quick Tips, the WordPress video series. In this video, I'm going to add the live chat widget on the WordPress website to capture the leads. I'm going to use the Go High Level services to add the live chat widget on the WordPress website. It can be used on any other website. It is not only for the WordPress website. You can simply enter the code on any other website and it will show the live chat widget on any website. In the previous video, I have shown you how to create a simple contact form for the WordPress website and capture the leads for the email marketing automation. We also created a simple email marketing automation workflow in the previous video. If you have not watched the previous video, I'll give you the link in the description box. You can see how we can create a simple email marketing automation using Go High Level Services. There are many different features in the Go High Level Services under one account. If you want to see all the features of Go High Level Services, I'll give you the link in the description box. You can visit the website and you will see many different features that you can use under one account. Now, let me show you the example of of the live chat widget. So here I'm on the website and in the bottom right hand corner, you will see the live chat widget icon. If I click on it, it will open the form. Here, your customers will be able to enter their contact details. Let me add some dummy details here. And they can click on send. Once the customer fills up the form, they will see the message here. Thank you. One of our representatives will contact you shortly. Now this contact will be added automatically on your Go High Level Services dashboard. Let me go back to the dashboard. You will see the contact is added in the contact list. Here you will see the message that I have entered from where the customer has contacted. You will see all the details on the dashboard. So it is going to create a contact immediately in the dashboard. And you can use this contact list for the email marketing, SMS marketing, call marketing, voicemail marketing. Facebook Messenger, Instagram, direct message, manual SMS, manual call, Google My Business Messaging. So there are many different automations you can create using this contact list. So let's see how we can create the live chat widget and install it on the WordPress website using Go High Level Services. Do not forget to subscribe to Quick Tips YouTube channel. Watch new videos about website design, e-commerce websites, search engine optimization, social media marketing, WordPress tutorials, video editing tips, and many more. Press the bell icon to get instant notification whenever we publish new videos. So here I'm logged into the dashboard of the Go High Level Services. In the previous video, we created a contact form to capture the leads on the WordPress website. We also created a simple workflow for the email marketing. So this is not just the email marketing tool. There are many different features that you can use. Now in this video, we are going to create web chat for the WordPress website. So let's go back to the dashboard of the Go High Level Services. Go to Sites. And here you will see the option Chat Widget. Click on Chat Widget. Here you will see the settings of the chat widget. This is the chat bubble. The next one is the message on the chat bubble. That is, hi there, have a question, text us here. So if you want to change it, you can make changes to the text here. Now this is the image. If you want to change the image, you can simply click on edit image and enter your own image here. So I'm going to keep this one. So this is the image that you will see here. Enable custom greetings. Here you will see return visitors, the message for the return visitors. So if you have a customer or the visitor who is returning to your website, then the customer will see this message. Welcome back and the name of the visitor. If you want to make changes to this message, you can make changes here. Now chat window. Now this is how the chat window will look. Have a question. This is the title here. Have a question. Enter your question below and a representative will get right back to you. So this is the message. So here you will see that message. Add email field. Right now there are three fields, name, mobile phone and message. If you want to add email field, you can simply enable this one. And here you will see the email field is added. Now this is the legal message. Here you will see the message. By submitting, you agree to receive SMS or emails for the provided channel. Now this is the color, widget color. If you want to change and if you want to match it with your website color combination, you can make changes from here. So I'm going to change this color. Let's use this one. Agency branding. You you can use your agency branding here. You need to enter the URL so that it will show here. So let's see if I delete this URL, you will not see the agency branding. You can enter the website URL here. Now here you will see powered by 
your website name here now acknowledgement settings customer support number customer support contact so this is how it will show thank you if you add number here or you can also add email address so here you will see the email address is added thank you and one of our representatives will contact you shortly so this is how it will show when the customer submit the form okay let's go to let's save this form now we need to integrate this form on the website we need to show this form on the website so here you will see the option get code if you have a wordpress website you can download and install the plugin on your wordpress website we will install it in both the ways we will use the plugin also and i'll show you how to add the code on the website so even if you do not have wordpress website you can enter the chat code and it will show on any website so let's see we will start with the get code you can click on it and you will see the code wire code or wire gtm so i'm going to use wire code so this is the code that we are going to use copy the code now let's go to the dashboard of your wordpress website so this is a wordpress website I'm going to use the code and after that I'm going to use the plugin also here on this website I'm using Astra theme we need to enter this code in the header section of the website if you are using any other theme you will see the option to edit the header section in case of Elementor or the hello theme you can use the custom codes let me show you here you can go to custom code go to Elementor go to custom code and you can create a code for the header so you can enter the chat code on the header section now in this case i'm using astra theme let me show you how to edit the astra theme header go to appearance and go to theme file editor here you will see header.php click on it if you are using any other php website or any other website on a different cms you can edit the header section of your website so here I'm going to enter the code. Let me enter the code. You need to enter the code before the head section. Here you will see the head section before the end of the head section. So this is the code for the end of the head section. You need to paste it above this end of head section. Let's update the file. Now let me visit the website. And here you will see the chat widget on your website. This chat widget will show on all the pages of website. If you click on it, it will open the chat widget. So this is how you can install the chat code manually on the header section of your website. Now let me delete it and we will use the plugin. So I have deleted the header section. Let me refresh it. Now it is gone. Now let's go to plugins and click on add new plugin let's close this one and it shows get it for wordpress so this is the plugin name lead connector let's go back to website and search for lead connector you can also download it from here so this is the plugin you can see it here click on install now click on activate now here you will see the option lead connector click on it now here we need to enter the api key so let's go back to the dashboard of the go high level here you can go to the agency view switch to agency view if you have got the account from your agency you can contact the agency view and from there you can get your api key so right now we are on the agency view go to settings and go to api keys and here you will see the API key for this account. So I'm going to copy this one. Let's go to, let's go back to the WordPress website and enter the API key here. And we need to enable the chat widget. Click on pull and save. Let's click on it, refresh it. And now you will see the chat widget here. So this is how you can use the WordPress plugin to enable the chat widget on your website. Now, if you are using funnels, you can link your funnel to this chat widget. So if you are using funnel pages, let's see if you are if you have created a sales funnel page, the chat widget is not going to show on the sales funnel page. You will need to enable that manually here. So let's go back to the dashboard of the go high level. Switch to the 
user view. Go to sites and here you will see the option funnels. So if you are using funnel, let me show you create a new funnel. Okay, so here you will see different templates for the funnels. So you can use any funnel template and you can use that code on your website. You can create a sales funnel here on the dashboard of the go high level and show it on your website. If you want to show the chat widget on the sales funnel page, you can simply link the sales funnel page. You can simply link your sales funnel page here. So right now I have not created any funnel. In the upcoming videos, I'll create one of the funnels and I'll show you how to create funnels. So let me close this one. Let's go back to chat widget. Now we will see how does this work. So let's go back to the website. I'm logged into the website in a different browser now and we are going to test this chat widget. So here you will see the chat widget. I'm going to click on it and I'm going to enter the name here. Let's add some dummy name here mobile number I'm going to add some dummy mobile number here okay so this is the message let's click on send here you will see the branding also click on send and you will see the message this is the email address thank you one of our representatives will contact you shortly let's go back to the dashboard of the go high level now let's go to contacts and here you will see the listing of the contact. This is the person who has filled up the chat widget form. And you will see the details here. Contact created, chat widget, chat widget form, from which page you have got this contact request page visited. And here you will see the message that the customer has entered, testing the chat widget. That was the message that I entered here. Now using this contact, you can also create email marketing automation you can also create a workflow for the email marketing automation so this is how you can use the chat widget on your website and you can start capturing the leads using the chat widget so that's it for now see you in the next video do not forget to subscribe to my channel to get more quick tips about online softwares and tools if you have any questions please leave us message in comment section and press the like button if you like the video thanks for watching quick tips